So all my years of riding bike, I've never seen anything as crazy as this. And this is actually one of Beck's favorite bikes. Go and have a look at this. This is the Cyclete, made and manufactured by hand in a workshop in San Francisco. Pretty weird, eh? So what we're gonna do, we're actually gonna take this out for a bit of a jaunt, and it's the normal Kinver route that we normally go on, which has some sketchy little bits on, if you're not prepared for it, or if you're on a bike other than a really good mountain bike. Let's see how Beck does. And off we go on a bleak September's morning. Yep, this is a sign of things to come. And you may think this bike is particularly difficult to ride. I assure you it's not. It's as easy as riding a bike. But can it keep up with me on a downhill section? Don't worry you wooden walkers out there. This is six o'clock in the morning. There's no one around. And the answer is yes, she kept up. But what about a few tight and twisty sections? Let's take a look at that. <laughs> and no problem there either. What about uphill? A little yes. bit skittish, but it made it. I think the only disadvantage to this bike is, when you come to a fence, you've got to lift your bike over. Yeah, it's a little bit of a faff. But not too bad considering it's 300 feet long. Yeah, I know, everyone's looking at this bike thinking, that looks incredibly ridiculous. But it must have a purpose. What's it for? And one of the answers to that is touring. These bikes are incredibly comfortable. There's no pressure on any of your joints as you're going along. And for that reason, the other answer is rehabilitation. For any injured runners out there, this is a great way to have non-load bearing exercise. But if you did like the video, like and subscribe, more content coming soon. It's time for us to get back. And on a cold morning like today, there's nothing better than a well-deserved hot cup of coffee. We'll see you soon.